welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, don't forget to check out my social media channels. In today's video, I have been asked, can I compare Game Loop and Bluestacks 4 in the new Call of Duty Mobile, but on the brand new Battle Royale mode? And the answer to that question is yes I can and that is why I have done this video. To start off with, first I'm just going to show you that I have set the same settings in both emulators. As you can see on the screen right now, the display is the same and if we go down to engine, you can see all the settings in engine are the same and also our game settings are the same. We're now going to boot up Call of Duty Mobile and I'm just going to show you the Battle Royale settings just to show you that I have set the graphics the same and the Battle Royale graphics are the same. As you can see, all the graphics settings in Call of Duty Mobile are the same in both emulators. It's now time to jump into game and see which emulator is the best when playing Battle Royale mode in Call of Duty. Comment below and let everyone know which emulator you think is going to be the best. Don't forget to share with everyone what frames per second you were getting in Call of Duty by taking a screenshot and then hashtagging computer sluggish on Instagram. And there you have it, that is how well both emulators got on with Battle Royale mode and I actually have mixed feelings. Because Game Loop done absolutely amazing in Team Deathmatch and Bluestacks didn't do as good. But in Battle Royale mode, I found Bluestacks 4 actually ran a lot better than Game Loop did. I found Game Loop really did drop a lot of frames per second and actually became a lot more unresponsive than Bluestacks. Which means for Battle Royale mode, I definitely would recommend you use Bluestacks over Game Loop. And that really has got me confused. I cannot understand why Bluestacks does amazing in Battle Royale mode, but on the other hand, Game Loop does absolutely fantastic in Team Deathmatch. But anyway, I hope this video has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social channels.